Yeah. I'm trying to decide whether or not to go with love. I guess you should always go with love, you know? Okay, I'm going to read you a love poem. I was just in Arizona and um, I was uh, hanging out with a new friend. It was like, you know, one o'clock in the morning. I had just done a show. And um, while I was on the couch hanging out with her, she was sexting. I think she was sexting by the look on her face. <laughs> Somebody who was at this show tonight. I don't know who you are, but I know you are here. And um, I, just, I, I just want you to know the look on that person's face. Uh, you, you are a good sexter. Okay. This is sort of church music, which I like. Uh, I like queering up the church. You will never be let down by anyone more than you will be let down by the one you love most in the world. It's how gravity works. It's why they call it falling. It's why the truth is harder to tell. Every year you have more to lose. But you can bury your past in the garden by the tulips. Water it till it is so alive. It lets you go. And you belong to yourself again. When you belong to yourself again, remember forgiveness is not a tidy grave. It is a ready loyal knight kneeling before your royal heart. Call in your royal heart. Tell it bravery can never be measured by a lack of fear. It takes guts to tremble. It takes so much tremble to love. Every first date is a fucking earthquake. Sweetheart, on our first date, I showed off all my therapy. I flew onto the couch where I finally sweat out my history. I pulled out the photo album from the last time I wore a lie to the school dance. I smiled and said, that was never my style. Look how fixed I am. Look how there's no more drywall on my fist. Look how my wrist is not something I have to hide, I said. Well, I was hiding it. The telephone pole still down from the storm. By our third date, I'd fix the line. I said, listen. I have a hard time. I mean, I cry as often as most people pee, and I don't shut the door behind me. I'll be up in your face screaming, Seattle is too rainy, Seattle is too rainy, I'm never gonna be able to live here, I sobbed on our fourth day. I can't live here, in my body, I mean. I can't live in my body all the time. It feels too much, so if I ever feel far away, no, I am not gone. I am just underneath my grief, adjusting the dial of my radio faith so I can take this life with all of its love and all of its loss because I already know you are the place. I'm gonna finally sing without any static, meaning I'm never gonna wait that extra 20 minutes to text you back, and I'm never gonna play hard to get when I know your life has been hard enough already, when we all know everyone's life has been hard enough already. It's hard to watch. This game we make of love, like everyone's playing checkers with their scars, saying checkmate whenever they get out without a broken heart. Just to be clear, I don't want to get out without a broken heart. I intend to leave this life so shattered. There better be a thousand separate heavens for all my flying parts, and none of those parts are going to be wearing the romance from the overpriced vintage rack, meaning I don't want a single speed bike if I can't make it up the hill. I know exactly how many gears I'm going to need to love you well, and none of them look hip at the coffee shop. They'd all have God saying, Good job, you're finally not full of bullshit. You finally met someone who's gonna flatten your kneecaps into skipping stones. Baby, throw me. Throw me as far as I can go. I don't wanna leave this life without ever having come home. And I wanna come home to you. I can figure out the rain. Thanks, you. <laughs>